This is the work of Yinka Shonibare. We have come to look at the exhibition. Shonibare is an artist who does sculptures, pictures, drawings, films and photographs. I'm surprised that he does everything because um, you'd think of an artist just to do one thing. I do painting, sculpture, film and photography mainly because I get bored quite easily. So I like to keep it interesting, keep it exciting. It's a bit eccentric and unusual with all the colours. Why has he got a globe on his head? And why has he got a lamp on his head? You wouldn't see a person walking around with a globe on their head. It's intriguing, you, you can't. You can't just leave it alone, you can't just come out of your mind, you've got to know. See, it's really confusing me now. We've all got something different about the, the head. They're all earth, yeah. air, fire and water, aren't they as well? Everything in the world is made out of water and fire and earth and air. So this is to represent everything, to show that everything in the world comes from nature. We liked that especially because of how everything linked together. It looks like a ballerina stood on like an explosion mushroom cloud, thinking that this is an explosion of oil and the ballerina's just standing on it, dancing on it, taking it for granted. Why are the headless? The kind of dance that the dancer is doing is um, ballet and most of the time rich people do ballet. In the olden days, very long time ago, the heads of the rich people were cut off because they were too wealthy and they didn't share the money with everybody. So a lot of people do want to know um, why there are no heads and I tell them and I also think it's, um, it's a bit funny as well. I wouldn't have them in the house. Why not? Because they're headless and if you walked around at night they might get a bit strange and creepy. It's my favourite so far because it's got loads of extraordinary different colours. Why is the aliens on the like flying machines? Well, some people don't actually like people who don't look like them and and I think the alien sculptures are funny because they don't look like us. I want people to be nice to people who look different. I, mean, I like some science fiction and I think that you know I mean I enjoy I enjoy them and so the aliens are like some aliens in old-fashioned science fiction. They also, they look a bit like E.T. as well. I think that he's made these sculptures to leave people asking questions about them.